All right, I'm going to go over some of the best smelling fragrances of all time. I'm going to start out with this one. It's Stronger With You Leather. This, I think, is the best Stronger With You fragrance. It has leather in it, but it's not a heavy leather. It's more of a supporting leather. It makes the fragrance pop and last longer and just smell amazing. I think it's blended perfectly. Great performance. I get eight hours of this. Compliment point fragrance. I absolutely love it. If you want a beautiful gourmand hazelnut toffee with leather, check out Stronger With You Leather. Next up, my favorite, Zurjoff. It's a beautiful chocolate with a nice sweetness. It is symphonium. Absolutely adore this fragrance. I think it's phenomenal. I get good performance. I get about eight hours with this. It is a beautiful, warm fragrance. So in the cold months, I think this is just beautiful. I can see this working in like spring and fall also, but I think really your winter time, this is the best fragrance possible. I absolutely love it. Beautiful chocolate, beautiful sweetness. Zurjoff symphonium. Next up from Zara, Tobacco Sublime. This is a light tobacco fragrance. Absolutely smells amazing. I got a compliment the last time I wore it. I think this is insanely good. For what you're paying, I think I paid 30 bucks for this, you're getting a killer, classy, gentlemanly like type light tobacco fragrance. And again, performance could be a little bit better though, unfortunately. I think I get about six hours with it, but oh my gosh, it's so good. I love it. And at the very beginning, when you put it on before it fully dries down, this is a killer scent. Love it so much. Dry down is good, but it does change towards the end. It gets a little bit light. But again, Beautiful tobacco, tobacco sublime from Zara. Now, you want classy fragrance, get Gilman Givenchy Reserve Privé. This is a beautiful fragrance. It smells a little bit similar to your Dior Homme Intense style fragrance. You get that iris, you get that Gilman to it. This has booze in it, and that booze really works perfectly for this fragrance. It will make you smell classy in the office. You want the best office fragrance. This is one of them. This is killer. Check out from Givenchy Reserve Privé. One of my all-time favorite fragrances is from Salvatore Ferragamo. Is this one? It is spicy leather. This is a perfect blend of spices and leather with a nice sweetness in there. The leather again is not heavy. This is not a heavy leather scent, although I am a big leather fan. The spices are beautifully blended. Neither one is fighting the other one. They just work all together. All three notes are perfection with this fragrance, and it does work in the summer. That's when I got it. I got it in the summer, and this was a perfect pickup. Glad I got it. Uh, it isn't the most pricey fragrance. I think you can pick it up for about one thirty from Salvatore Ferragamo themselves. Great fragrance. Thankfully, it's in America now. Spicy leather. All right, one of my favorite from Bulgaria is this. It's Man in Black. I love this fragrance. This is a beautiful, spicy fragrance with classiness, nice little bit of sweetness, depth, a little bit of chocolatiness to it. I am obsessed with this fragrance. Uh, Spice Bomb EDT smells very similar. They're kind of almost identical, but not. They're, they're, they're close. They're brothers. They're close brothers. Might even be twins. But this is a killer fragrance. Performance, I uh, get about six hours. Wish I got more because this is a killer fragrance. Bulgari did come out with a newer version of this. I haven't been able to find it yet. Hopefully it's better. I think it's a parfum version. Um, if it lasts longer and you get the similar DNA with maybe a little bit of modernness to it, I would pick it up in a heartbeat. Love this. Again, Man in Black from Bulgari. One of my newest, most recommended fragrances is this. It's Ocean Noir from Michael Malol. Killer summer fragrance. It is similar to a Dylan Blue style fragrance, but the depthness is insane. Beautiful fragrance. Could be perfect in any situation. Office, daytime, evening time, date night, office. Uh, said office already flights, you name it. This is a killer fragrance. Very uh, interesting fragrance for an oceanic summertime fragrance. That's rare to find. And I absolutely love this. Performance-wise, I get about 10 hours, 8 to 10 hours with it. Great fragrance. Highly recommend it from Michael Malol Ocean Noir. One of my newest fragrances, and actually it is my most newest that I've received, is this one here. It is from Harmony. It's Vanilla X Plum. This is similar to the sweetness that Rapira has. Doesn't smell the same, but it's very similar. Vanilla, though, blends perfectly with this fragrance. You get a killer fragrance. Great performance. It's an extrait de parfum. I am absolutely obsessed with this fragrance. It is gorgeous. I can't wait to wear this more often. I think this is a compliment beast mode fragrance, and it has great projection. You're going to get about 10 to 12 hours performance with it. Highly recommend it. If you go to Harmony's website, use the code NUBS10, save you 10% off your order. Oh my gosh. Love this fragrance. Vanilla X Plum. Now, a beautiful amber fragrance. Oh my gosh. This will make you smell classy. Interesting in the office. You will be the best smelling person. It could also work in school. It is Prada Black. This is a beautiful amber. I think this is gorgeous. It's unique. It's interesting. It doesn't smell like just a normal fragrance. This is a gentleman fragrance for the classiest of the class. And oh my gosh, I love this fragrance. Performance is okay. Six hour range with it. But man, the scent is just incredible. I absolutely love the scent of this fragrance. Definitely worth a pick up. Check out Prada Black. Now, one of my favorite fall fragrances, it might be actually my favorite fall fragrance, is this. It's from Mason Alhambra. It's exclusive to back. This is a fragrance that is inspired by Carolina Herrera Mystery Tobacco. I have not smelled that fragrance, but now that I've smelled this and I love this, again, think tobacco, vanilla with a little bit of amber, I want to smell Carolina Herrera Mystery Tobacco. I cannot wait to get that fragrance, and that is one that I really want to get this year, and it's all because of this fragrance here. So if clones can make you want to get the original, because normally the original smells a little bit richer and royaler, then these are worth it. But oh my goodness, for 30 bucks, you can get this online. 
This is a killer fragrance. Decent performance. You're going to get about eight hours with it, maybe close to the six, but it is a beautiful wear. Interesting, unique. I love this fragrance so much. If you want something that is tobacco, vanilla, with a little bit of amber, check out Exclusive Tobacco from Mason Alhambra. My former favorite fragrance is this from Ace Miyake. It is Noir Ombre. I love this fragrance. It's a beautiful, fresh fragrance with spices in it. It works great in the summer, great in the winter, great any time of the year. Very versatile. I am obsessed with this fragrance. This used to be if I had a bad day, my go to fragrance, I just spray it and immediately I feel happy. My life was better, everything was perfect. Um, this is a harder to get fragrance because it is a Middle Eastern exclusive release. You can pick it up like fragrancebuy.ca or Joma Shop. They still have them, they still pop them out, but they're harder to find. So if you don't see it, just keep checking. Eventually, it'll pop back up, hopefully. Um, but Killer Fragrance, I'm so glad I picked this up when I had a chance. Nor Ombre, Killer Fragrance from Issey Miyake. Now, my current favorite fragrance is this from JPG. It is Lamal Le Parfum. I think this is the perfect fragrance. It's very classy. It's similar to the Lamal vibe. You get that beautiful lavender barbershop DNA. But this is modern. has vanilla. The vanilla blends perfectly. Makes the smell both sexy, sporty, and classy all at once. This is now my current feel-good fragrance. So again, you speak Issey Miyake. Now, if I have a bad day, I will put this fragrance on, and I always instantly feel better or just even smell it. Killer fragrance. Highly recommend it from JPG, La Malle Profonde Performance. I get roughly about eight hours personally. Some say they get worse. Some say they get better. I think eight hours is kind of the average. Um, Killer Fragrance, thank you so much, JPG. Great fragrance. Now, the next two are two fragrances I think smell amazing. I wish I had better performance because if they did, I'd recommend them all the time. From Bond Number no. 9, Greenwich Village. Personally, I think if this fragrance had another four hours performance, this actually might be my favorite fragrance. This is classy. It is a little bit of sweet, a little bit of barbershop, a little bit unique. I am obsessed with this fragrance. It smells absolutely amazing oh my gosh i just i only get four hours with it that's the problem but for scent alone this is incredible highly recommend it i love this fragrance so much uh if you get more than four hours for a uh, performance i would test this out and see because if you do this is a great fragrance you will smell incredible from bond number no. nine greenwich village now honorable mention is from pdm it is herod i think herod is actually the best scent that parfums and has ever made unfortunately i only get six hours of performance if i had more that would be one I'd highly recommend. It's a beautiful cherry pipe tobacco style fragrance. I don't know if cherry is even listed, but the style of the tobacco is that cherry tobacco that you get in a pipe. It is insanely good. It smells phenomenal. A bit basic, not the most intricate, but I think the scent is just the best thing they've ever put out. Again, performance is what lets it down. You only get about six hours. So honorable mention, love that fragrance. Now, my favorite all-time scent. Unfortunately, again, performance is the problem. I only get two hours with this and then about three more, and then it goes skin scent and dies immediately. Is from Chanel. It's Allure Elm Sport Oh Extreme. This could be the greatest scent ever made. Again, performance is the problem. If Chanel would come out with a version that lasted eight to 10 hours, this would probably be everybody's everyday all time fragrance. It smells phenomenal. Love the scent so much. Cannot wait to wear it every time I wear it. But unfortunately, again, I only get a max of like five hours. And it's usually close to that three and a half, maybe four hour range. And then it just disappears. So again, for scent purposes alone, I have to include this because this smells phenomenal. Very sporty, very sexy, great fragrance. Way to go, Chanel. Please come out with like an elixir version that lasts a long time because this is amazing. So those are some fragrances I think smell amazing. Some of the best smelling fragrances of all time. What did I forget? What should I put in the list? As always, comment down below. Thanks for following the channel. I'll talk to you soon.